Of course, confidence does not come immediately. As we get into the details, most people at some point doubt their ability to absorb it all and understand how to respond to what the examiners want to see in exam answers. And this leads some people to attempt to find more and more resources. There are loads on the internet. You can, but I recommend against gathering more and more. Instead, focus on reading what you have, rewriting the lists, redrawing the diagrams. One of the hardest parts of preparation is just having the faith that the course materials are enough and you don't have to do more and more and more and more. There's no end to how much you can actually do. The full course with the work files is more than enough. Read what is provided once through quickly to get breadth, depth and scope. Then perhaps read again more slowly for understanding and then perhaps a third pass to fill in the gaps that practice exam questions have revealed. Believing the preparation work is everything you need to know is one of the hardest parts of preparation. It is everything you need. As we shall see as we go, they can only ask you about what is in the syllabus, which is different for every exam, but the same for most of the exam questions. One of the hardest parts of exam preparation is believing that the preparation work is enough. And it is. Because they can only ask you about what's in the scenario or what's in the syllabus. The syllabus is the same for every exam. The scenario is different for every exam. You have the opportunity to practice everything that's in the syllabus from the perspective of two scenarios for the foundation and practitioner exams included in the course materials here. You can do these repeatedly in order to aid your recall. And you will be, as you proceed, prepared. If you follow through everything that's included in the course materials, then you can approach the exam calmly, knowing that you have prepared. There are only two elements that they can ask you about in the exam or that you will need to demonstrate in the exam. So the first element is the content of the official manual, which is a blue-grey covered book, but is thoroughly replaced by the reference materials that we provide you with here, and exam technique. And I'm going to cover that very shortly, and you may, of course, review that coverage as many times as you like.